Hi everybody, I am Melody Johnson and I work here at the King Public Library as the Children's Programmer. And I am Chris Wolf and I work as the Adult Programmer. And we are here to introduce you to our summer learning program, Tales in Tales. We will be doing a series of backyard habitats. Our first one will be bug hotels. So let's get started. What you will need is a bucket full of twigs and sticks and all kinds of stuff. I went out in our backyard here and gathered those. You will need a tin can that has been cleaned and rinsed and ready to go. You will need a can opener and you will need a handy dandy pair of snippers. Try to get a pair that's big enough to cut some of these twigs. Some of them are pretty big. When you're selecting your cans, make sure that you pick a can that has an inner rim and not one of these rounded cans because it's hard to get the uh, can opener to work with this one. So you're going to take the one with the inner rim and you're going to take your can opener and you're going to take the bottom off. And if you need to, make sure you get a parent to help you so you don't get hurt. And definitely Now that Miss Chris has our can ready and I can see through it and I got a nice big hole, what you're going to do next is you're going to make sure your sticks are about the length. That one's way too big. So let me find you one so we can show you. So you just want a little bit sticking out just like that and we're going to start lining them on the inside. You can do big ones. Make sure to get some good ones that they can eat the inside out of because they're going to love this right here. They're going to hang out in here and eat all these sticks and live in all this dry leaves because that's what you're going to do. Put some dry leaves in there and they're just going to have a happy little home in here. Been filling up our bug hotel. It has leaves and all kinds of twigs in there. I have just a few more that I'm going to put in. Let me show you how we've been doing it. And I've been taking some dry leaves and sticking in there because they love that. They will eat that up and have them some nice little homes in there. So when you're all done, it should look just like this right here. You can make two or three or five. And you can line them all upside, all outside in your garden, and you'll have all kinds of awesome creepy crawly critters that will come. So I hope you've enjoyed this edition of Backyard Habitats. The next Backyard Habitat we will be doing will be bird feeders. And um, next week though, we will be doing origami rap rabbits. <laughs> Got a little tongue tied there. We'll be showing you how to fold origami rabbits and how to make origami corner bookmarks. They're really cool, so I can't wait for that. I wanted to show you some of the other things that you can come and pick up. This is our summer reading flyer. It will tell you everything that we're gonna be doing this summer. They will be virtual, so you won't be able to come into the library and see us in person. But we will have all of these posted every Wednesday for you. Also, I want everybody to come by and get them a summer learning packet. This will have all kinds of activities and fun things for you guys to do. It also has all the information that you need to do any of the programs that we will be doing this summer. Everything you need will be right in here. So come on by and grab yours today and sign up for summer reading because we want you guys to keep reading and having fun all summer long. June 1st was our sign up, so come get your reading log and start earning prizes today. Well, me and Miss Chris are going to go get ready for our next program, so I hope y'all have a wonderful day. We'll see you guys later. Bye!